Hello, I'm Coach Bruce Tracy from Carl Sandburg College Cross Country. I'd like to tell you a little bit about this year's team. We're, we've started practices and I'd like to tell you first about the strengths of our team. We have on both men's and women's teams, we have four returning people which are very fine people which will be leaders for our team. Um, then also we had a very strong recruiting year. We have large numbers this year which will uh, bring us into a really solid performance. There's, we have people which are training very close together this year. We have our individuals, both returning people and our new people, have probably more years of qualifying state experience and sectional experience than we've ever had before. And they're running together and I think they'll progress together very strongly throughout the season. Team leaders this year, um, I'll tell you first about the women's leaders. We have, I would say, a group of three that'll be way up front and they'll be our team leaders. Um, it's hard to tell at this point who's going to be the, the one that will take us all the way through the season. They may mix up throughout the year. And then short, close behind all the, the main three, we've got a group that's it's hard to tell each day who's going to be the strongest one. They'll finish as a pack and, and we'll be a strong team that way. Then on our men's team, uh, we have a lot of new people and some very strong people. On our men's team, we have a lot of people who have never even done the sport before that are quickly becoming stars at this sport. They're, they're running very fast and I'm very happy with them. Uh, so actually I don't know who our team leader will be with the men's team. When I talk to the team about team goals, we're not going to set an end, end of the year team goal at this point. We're going to take it from the first uh, cross country meet of the season. We may set some mild goals for the team in terms of time and, and place. But uh, we, in order to peak at the end of the season and do our best at the end of the season, we won't really talk about the end of the season goals until it gets into October. During the four meets in September, we'll go week to week and see the progress each week. And then during that week, we'll talk with each individual about the goals for the season. Um, I think we by October, we should have some very set goals and some very high ones with all the, the good prospects we have in, in both the men's and the women's. I think we could very well say possibly our women's team could be a regional champion. I think that's very possible with the people we have. And our men's team could be in the, in the upper group also. Another great thing about uh, this team that I want to close with is the, the thought we have a really good base group now and it's very large. And I think with the success this year that we, I think we'll have, and we have already some good strong commitments from people who are already in high school, or still in high school, starting their uh, different years in high school. We have verbal commitments of probables from them. I think we look very good from, for the future. Um, also, I want to mention the fact that we ha still have our assistant coach back from last year, Coach Karen Brophy, and we've added a new coach was gonna, which is going to make three knowledgeable people coaching this year. Uh, coach Rodney Blue has come and joined our forces and he adds a lot of experience and a lot of uh, impact to our team.